Hello everyone, this is Tracy, your Wasteland Witch, or if you prefer, your Wasteland Bunny. Either way, here we are with another video. I'm very excited to have done this one. This has been in the back of my mind for a long time. And now that it's spooky season, I figured this was the perfect chance to do this camp and make sure that you please like this video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share, whatever moves you. Every little bit helps this channel grow. And I also need to say that I have done this in a custom world. You can do the same merging tricks in adventure mode, but the one thing that you can't really do in adventure mode that you can do in custom worlds is you can have you can float your lights anywhere you want you don't need to have them connected you don't even need a generator because you can choose to have your camp always powered on and so that's why i opted to do it in custom worlds so with all that being said i also need to mention that after the tour i'm going to have a little show and tell so make sure to stick around for that and now we're going to get into the video. There have been hundreds of productions of Little Shop of Horrors. Because of this, most productions will have their own variation on the set design. And since this functions more as a set piece than as a practical camp, I decided to emulate that. In this version, the shop is well stocked with garden decorations, flower plots, plants, and other accessories. I decided to make the scene look sinister, so I merged light posts into most of the items so that they would be underlit. And I chose red for the primary color since it fits the theme. For the spore plant, I floated a green cycling light into it. And in custom worlds, you can opt to have your camp always powered on, so you don't need to worry about connecting any wires. 
For the display cases, I use free placement mode to sink them into the foundation, as well as to place items on top of the glass. Now, while the inclusion of Seymour and Audrey adds to the atmosphere, the Greek chorus girls, Crystal, Ronette, and Chiffon completes the scene. After all, they are the storytellers of the musical, and without them, this little wasteland tale would not be complete. So thank you for watching. Please make sure to like this video and tell a friend. And have a happy and safe Halloween.